literally every time I get in this freaking car, the sun is doing something weird. I'm sorry. Uh, hi, hi, welcome to a new vlog. I was originally going to separate this into two videos, but now I'm just really not feeling like it. Um, we're just going to vlog today, and it's a big day. It's a fun day. Uh, for one, it's a very sad day because it is, in fact, 9-11. It is Patriots Day. Super sad. Um, and it hit me last night at work. I think, yeah, last night at work that uh, I'm getting old enough that there are people that were not alive when 9-11 happened, like, that I can work with. And there's a lot of people that just have no recollection because they were so young. So weird to me. I was six when 9-11 like became 9-11 instead of just being, you know, you know what I mean? I, w I was six when that happened. It was very weird. Uh, but anywho, day of remembrance, super sad, but uh, my videos, man, the vlogging, lighting in this car, whatever. Um, we are on our way currently to a local Mexican restaurant because my brother moved, I don't know how well y'all keep up with my life, my brother moved out of town not that long ago and it really sucks. My brother and I um, are very close, so hate not getting to see him as much. And because of COVID, we are both in the healthcare field. Uh, I just don't get to see him very often at all. But he is in town today. We're gonna grab some lunch. My mom has Ellie right now because I worked last night and my mom just likes getting to hang out with her grandkid. Uh, I was going to, we were all going to go and get something to eat. Me, my mom, David, and Ellie. My mom and Ellie, apparently, uh, Ellie woke up really early this morning, so she said to just go on without her and that they're going to take a nap. So, I'm on my way to the restaurant. We're going to eat lunch with David, and then we're going to go, this lighting, we're going to go try to find Halloween full decorations yes I have decorations from last year I swear to god if I knew how to fix the lighting I would fix it it's literally just the sun I have stuff from last year I really thought I had way more than what I did because when James brought that toad in from our storage building I was like is that all is that all I have that ain't gonna work so my mount is fucking up today too we are gonna go eat and then we're gonna go try to find some more decorations and stuff. I know I wanna hit up Burke's and the Dollar Tree and then I'm probably gonna stop at Rose's and Walmart. I was also gonna go get the back of my hair stacked, like cut into a stack um, from where I cut it off myself at my house. It actually came out relatively, relatively well. Uh, I was gonna go get it stacked, but it's all pretty well the same length right now, and since I'm not intending on keeping my hair short, I just want to grow it back out. I don't think I'm gonna go get it stacked, just because that'll add so many different lengths into my hair. But whatever. So, welcome to another vlog. I just wanted to, like, give y'all a little intro what we're doing. It is 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and we're gonna go... I'm going to, I want to spend time with my brother, but it is my only day off this week, so I kind of got to do my running today. I know for positive we're going to Walmart because I have to get laundry pods and Walmart has the cheapest one. We're headed to the restaurant. I will probably check in with you there. Yes, you can say hello to the David and then we will do our running and then we're going to go get my chitlin. Also, when we gotta go home, I gotta get, I gotta get on laundry because I work all weekend. So yeah, check back in. What are you vlogging? I'm just vlogging my day, calling me shopping. David's here. We ate lunch. He's being weird. He ate really fast, and I did not. Would you quit being so weird? <laughs> It was unexpected. Would you like some chimichanga? No, I'm fine. It's 
my second favorite Mexican thing. Dish. Dish. It's not really a Mexican food though. It's kind of like a. I think it was some bullshit made in California. To be honest with you. Hmm. Mm. David's here. Super zoomed in on your face right now. What do you guys think of my new hairdo? Yeah, he said he's trying to grow out his hair and do something different. I prefer short hair. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't made up my mind. Yeah. I haven't made up my mind on it. Okay. Happy spooky bitch season. Happy spooky bitch season. Let me, let me click you up here. Maybe. Lord. Yeah, here we go. Hi. Um, so we are parked outside of my Burks and uh, we're gonna go in. It is now 5.15. Me and my brother got to talking. Also, my lips went to shit because <laughs> I was eating, but it's fine because I have to wear a mask. Totally good. Um, yeah. Also, he gave me back my stethoscope. <laughs> uh, I, uh, I don't know how to explain. Okay. My mom has been a nurse for f 15 years. Uh, I've been a CNA for five and a half, six years or so. And my brother has been EMT slash paramedic for two to three and he needed a stethoscope when he first started and I let him borrow my Litman and he uh, finally gave it back. I mean, that's always nice. So uh, yeah, let's uh, go in here. I might take a few clips in here. I always say that and the only reason I never do is because I get really uncomfortable about people staring at me, but we's gonna go in here. We're gonna look at some goodies. Also, my magnetic lashes that I'm trying on. The eyeliner, I accidentally wiped it off in my inner corner so my lash randomly keeps popping, but it's fine. Yeah, let's go into Burks. When I get out of Burks, the Dollar Tree is right here. I'm gonna hop in there. Uh, and then I think I might skip out on Roses. Probably not, I'm gonna run in. And then we're gonna go to Walmart. There's somewhere else I was wanting to go. Burks, Dollar Tree, Walmart, Roses. No, that's right. And at Walmart, it's not just spooky bitch looking. I gotta, I gotta actually get like real necessities. So, let's go. Dollar Tree. I think I only got like three spooky things. Um, and Burks had really cute stuff. I think I took an actual clip inside of Burks. Um, but the only thing that I really wanted from Burks that I saw was they were like two like little skeleton. It was a bride and a groom. Very cute. Very, very cute. And they had like painted ones and then they had like gunmetal silvery ones, which are the ones I wanted. And there was something spilt all over them. And then when I picked it up to like look at it and look at the price, one, it was uh, $13 for the smaller one and $20 for the big one. And for those to be made of plastic, I wasn't jiving with it. So I skipped it. I only bought one thing in Burks and it wasn't even Halloween. It's for my baby. So that was kind of a bust. Um, I decided not to go into Roses because it's still a little early my little town to be putting out Halloween stuff so I'm gonna just head on up to the Walmart I'm sure I'll show you everything I bought when I get home so far I've only spent like 20 bucks which is good <laughs> James will be most appeased uh, also I didn't I'll have to show you when I'm not driving uh, Kroger put out their fall stuff and I went like Tuesday Tuesday night after work and it, they were setting everything up and I got two candles and like a pumpkin and a painting or no I got a pumpkin and like just a few little things and everything was full price and then I had to go back Thursday night last night and everything was marked down I'm a little distraught that I just spent full price on stuff for it to be marked down and I don't know why it's already marked down 
I mean, it make no sense. So, yeah. We're on our way to Walmart. Fun. No shame in my game. Uh, it's 8.30. We are at home. I went and picked up baby girl. Hi! Hi. She's eating skeddy sked. I have not eaten yet because James is on his way home. I got her diaper bag packed to go tomorrow because me and James both work again. And I've just been cleaning. My table is a wreck. So, it's a fine. I reckon I'm going to wait until James gets home. To show you everything I bought. This, um, my mom got it for. I'll show you in a minute. But it's so cute. I do have PJ masks on. I do have a few fall things happening. I do not have everything up though, obviously, because I'm still buying. But we are home. It is 8.30. Ellie is starting. She's just playing her food. So I'm going to give her a banana to see if she'll eat that. We're gonna continue to just pack stuff. I have to go through and clean out my work bag and redo it. And then uh, we have to, what is it? Oh, when James gets home, I gotta clean out his lunchbox and repack it, so. Just mom life today. I'll probably check in when Tinkle Pie here is in Jamie's and cleaned up. It is way later. It's 11.46. I'm working on homework, um, which is why we got glasses going on. And these have the blue, what are they called? The blue light block or whatever. Uh, and I feel like they look really weird on me, but whatever. I have, I'm really weird. And I always make a hard copy <laughs> of any paper I write. Yes, could I just type it out and make a, like, print out a copy? Yes, I could. But I like having a hard copy written down as, like, my first draft because as I'm typing it, I'll switch things around. And I don't know. It's, I'm working on English, and it's, like, the only subject in school that I'm, like, naturally good with and don't have to, like, actually focus very much. That sounds terrible. We do have shit that I bought and as soon as I get in with my homework I'm going to show you guys but I really needed to finish up my homework since it's getting kind of late Ellie went to bed she didn't want to go to bed at her normal time she probably ended up going down at about 10.30 she normally goes down about 9.30 but that's fine we're going to finish our homework and I'm going to show you the stuff we got and I need to take a few boxes of stuff to my car and uh then I'm gonna go get James off the couch because he fell asleep on the couch waiting on me to finish my homework should I have been working on my homework in the living room probably because you know I could focus better I wouldn't be laying in my bed but uh Ellie was snuggled up on the couch finishing a Disney movie so I just came in here my dog is starting to bark if she wakes up my child, I'm going to scream. So, yeah. That was just a little check-in. We'll talk more about, like, the shopping aspect of everything that's went down today whenever I get done with my homework. But I just wanted to do a little check-in. Make sure we didn't forget each other. I'll see you, like, in ten seconds for you. I'm done with my homework very randomly. Uh, let's go through this stuff. I'm going to prop this up so you can see it. So, this is a really cool print. And it, I really thought it was a canvas, but it's all wood. I bought this at Kroger, and I actually have something that is in the living room, but I uh, will look at it later. <laughs> um, this is from Kroger. It's really cool. They have this really nice, like, black with this dark burgundy color, which, handily, that is the accent color in my living room. And I'm planning on this probably staying up year-round. Um, I don't know why Kroger already has their stuff marked down. This was originally $19.99, and I got it for $13.99. Super cute. Don't mind my clothes. Then we went into Burks, and I just got Ellie these really cute little combat boots. They're by whatever that brand is, Tahari. And they're a little black, and they have quartz leopard print. 
little gold buckles. They're super cute. And they were $15. Hi. That's everything else I bought. Um, the dollar store didn't have everything out yet, but what they did have, don't worry, I went through. Um, I got two of these oven mitts that just say, if you've got it, haunt it. And they're really cute and black orange. And they have almost a red down here and then bright orange. Love them. Obviously, those were a dollar. And then I just got a matching kitchen towel. Uh, this technically was not uh, bought by me today, but I'm trying to make it look cute. I don't think it's going to work for me. My mom got this made for me. It's just um, an orange shirt and it just says Momster on it. I'm, I'm down. Super cute. Got that. I guess I'm going to just show you everything I got. I got a pair of jogger scrubs from Walmart. I wear Walmart scrubs quite often because I'm just poor. <laughs> but these are just cute. They're black. Hopefully they work out. No more joggers. And Ellie got the majority of the spooky bitch stuff today. We got her this little long sleeve shirt that says Boo Crew and it has dancing skeletons on it. How adorable. This isn't technically spooky, but we bought her today. This is just a little raglan with like the football stripe things on the sleeves and it just says love with a lightning bolt. I got Ellie a pair of just black jeggings and I'm gonna try to do this. <laughs> There's the little matching bloomer panties and then I got Ellie this little, it's gray and black leopard print. It's like a cute little t-shirt dress and it's long sleeves so that'll be cool. Will it be warm when it gets cool? Did that make sense? <laughs> and lastly, for Ellie, I found these really cute little leggings. They're black. They have little stars, yellow, orange, and white. Well, they're gold, but still. They have little jack-o'-lanterns and candy corn pieces on them, and I swear to God, it was just so cute. You can't even see in there. There's more. Let me dump it out. Also, one, I got this black marble trash can. Um, I have a white marble one that sits beside my vanity, and it's a pretty big trash can. I really like them. They were only $4, so I got a black one because I've decided this bathroom we're about to redo is going to be, it's going to have black marble instead of white marble. Um, I picked up the hair color I use. I'm not going to use that yet. My Walmart doesn't sell LA Colors, like the makeup, but they had this LA Colors um, full blending brush, and it was like two bucks never go wrong with more blending brushes uh that's the litman <laughs> my brother my brother gave me uh my litman back so i just brought that in the house and then i've talked about these before they were in a favorites it's the equate instant brush cleanser and they were on clearance for 250 and they're normally 698 <sighs> i'm a little upset so i bought two and i have almost a full bottle so i'm hoping that'll tide me over um, this is for me to take to work. Uh, I bring my own bath stuff for my residence. Um, wow, my sheet looks ratchet. These are the Axe Detailer Shower Tools. They're just like little loofahs on one side and it has like a rubber piece and then it has an exfoliating piece. And these are like four bucks and me and James both use them. So I bought two, but one's in the other bathroom and this one is for James's shower. Also, I could not help myself. These are the Kiss Impress um, Press-On Manicures. These are limited edition, and all three of them glow in the dark. So, I first got this. Do these have names? These have names. So, this is the Peekaboo set. It has some black nails, some mummy nails. It has, like, a little haunted house with bats. I know it's hard to see. And a jack-o'-lantern nail. This is the ICU. I really like these. So there's black and silver glitter nails, pale pink with spiders coming on them, and then black with silver spider webs. And lastly, we have hide and seek. So obviously there's like a black duochrome nail, white to gray ombre, then there's white to gray ombre with graveyards on them, and then a big old haunted house. I'm down for the count. Also, 
Hi, I have the value size Garnier micellar cleansing water. I get the waterproof one. Um, it's not as good as my Dermalogica pre-cleanse, but I don't have an Ulta near me, so I picked that up. It was 10 bucks. This is 23.7 fluid ounces, just for reference. It's 10 bucks. And then my sheet is literally falling off my bed. <laughs> and then my Walmart recently started carrying um, Bliss. Let me focus you. Yeah. My Walmart recently started carrying Bliss, um, which I've heard Skin Care by Hiram talk about. So I had to buy something. And this was also $10, and it's six and a half fluid ounces. And this is just their makeup melt. It says it's a dry, wet, gentle jelly cleanser with rose flowers. So, I'm just trying to find something cheaper than my $45 Dermalogica makeup remover I use. So, I saw thing we got for the most part today. Little crazy. But, yeah, this is not the end of my Halloween decor hunting because obviously I didn't get very much. Um, a lot of my stores didn't have very much out, which is why I wasn't really filming inside. So, that is it. For this segment, I'm going to put all this stuff up now. And I'm actually just going to wash my face using that new Bliss thing to take off my makeup. And then we're going to go to bed because it is 12.48. So, we go and do that. Good morning. Well, it's actually afternoon. It's like almost 1 o'clock. I have to be at work in an hour and I got my makeup done. And my dad is supposed to be coming by to pick up Elbel here. Who is dressed super cute today? Super cute. You want to tell him hi? Oh my goodness, you're such a big girl. Good job. Oh, you gonna give him a kiss? Say shh. <laughs> She's so cute. We're waiting on my dad to get here to pick her up. Ellie. <laughs> okay, give a kiss. Good job. Yes. Yeah, We're waiting on dad to come pick her up. And then I just got to finish doing my hair and get dressed. Yeah. It's going to be a big day at work. I have to do a few people's hair. Showers. Ah, ah, ah. You're such a psycho. But yeah. Oh, and it looks like she's got on lip gloss because she has a drool rash. And I have been informed to pat it dry and put petroleum jelly, like Vaseline situation on it. Are you going to turn the light on? Good job. Good job. High five it. She's such a smart baby. <laughs> hey, so I may have edited it all the way up to this point and realized I just kind of cut the vlog off like it wasn't nothing. SARS, I look disgustingly rough. The mask knee is real right now. But we're just hanging out. I just got Ellie dressed. It's my next day off, which is the next Friday. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure me and my chitlin are about to go. We have this like indoor... I don't know how to explain it. It's like a flea market, but it's not all, like, secondhand stuff, which I totally dig, too. Um, but they have a little booth where it's, like, a little kid boutique outfits. And I want to go see if uh, they got something for my kid. But other than that, we're just hanging out. Thanks for watching the vlog. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Have a good day.